Breaking news. Nigerian politician in big trouble after saying that police commissioner recruited talks. See what he must prove within 24 hours. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, depending on the time and where you're listening to this news from. This is Morning News. A very popular saying in Yoruba land says as tongue can kill hmm, and it can make. Why on earth will anyone make every allegation against the police force without having any proof? Recently, after losing an election, a powerful party leader drops a, an FT allegation, which is turned angers in police force. The Nigerian police force has given Farouk Adeojo, the spokesperson of the Social Democratic Party in Kogi State, a 24 hours deadline to provide additional details regarding his claim that betrayed Onoha, the commissioner of police was in charge of a lightning talks for a specific political party in the state. Arrested in Delta, in Delta State is a suspected gun runner. A Jodo accusation, according to Kogi State Police Command, spokesperson SP William Avoaya is a clear affront to the credibility and authority of the Nigerian police force. He also threatened to hold a, a judge accountable for his actions if he did not provide evidence to support his accusation against the police force, Com police force command, and also the commissioner of police. The police command does not belong to any political party. Our responsibility is to protect lives and properties. A mandate we have protected without fear or favor. Today, we received report of a protest gone wild worldwide at the state office of the Independent National Electoral Commission. The CP swiftly directed the development of officers and men of and men to restore menacy at the INEC office. Our concern is the protection of the staff and property of the Electoral Commission as well as the safety of the citizen transacting businesses around the INEC office. With the support of other security agencies, claim was restored at the INEC state headquarters. How the operation that restored peace at the INEC office has infuriated the Social Democratic Party is what we don't understand. The protesters who blocked the road and were burning tires to scare people were all wearing the fierce calves of the Social Democratic Party. The Kogi police spokesman said that said this in a statement. The statement added that the Kogi State Commissioner of Police has on unbiasedly directed a full investigation into the allegation raised by the SDP spokesperson to ensure sure that a final news is placed on attempt by politicians to drag the police force into partisan disagreement. Thank you viewers for listening to this news. Viewers, what is your take concerning what you've just heard? Your comment concerning this news will be very much appreciated. Please don't hesitate to drop them down below the comment box. Click on the subscription button as well as the bell button for more.